Hello video creators, welcome to HitPod channel. When we are creating new videos, it is common that we record the screen of our computer as video materials. While there are too many screen recording tools online and sometimes we waste too much time on testing these tools, rather than focusing on our videos. Though I want to recommend you the famous OBS, also known as Open Broadcaster Software. There are still lots of users who couldn't get used to it due to its complicated operation or some black screen cases during recording. So in this video, I will recommend some useful and trustworthy screen recording tools based on my video making experience. These tools are easy to use and will greatly save your time when making videos. Now let's dive in. All Windows 10 system has its own screen recorder that is Xbox Game Bar. It's an inbuilt tool which is particularly made for recording games. Most people don't know this because it's hidden in the system by default. To launch it, you need to press the Windows key and G to open it. Now click on the white dot button to start recording. Click again to stop the recording. If you're using macOS system, an inbuilt tool QuickTime Player can also be a useful tool to record your screen. Just click on the player. In the file menu, you can find a feature saying new screen recording. Click on it and the recording will be started. As you can see that the previous two tools can only fulfill simple recording requirements. If you're looking for a more professional screen recording tool, HitPaw Screen Recorder is a perfect choice. Whether you need to record screen, games, webcam, or record picture in picture, HitPaw Screen Recorder can all meet your requirements. I have put the free download link in the description below. Now let's see how it works. Firstly, launch HitPaw Screen Recorder. From the home interface, you will find three options. Click on the first option to record screen. Now you can single click to select the whole screen or select the defined window. You can click the icon in the bar to start, pause or end recording. It is also convenient to take screenshots with one click. You can also open the PIP feature, also known as picture in picture. This can record both webcam and the screen. This draw icon contains three options, pen, highlight, and arrow. These are the drawing tools for you to add some marks during recording. You can choose the suitable size and color, then drag mouse on the recording screen to mark the important content. Once you click the stop button, the software will end the recording and launch to the editing interface. You can click on the play icon to preview the video or start to trim it as you want. Then simply click on the open output folder to check the video. From the home interface, choose the record webcam option. Here you can choose the webcam you want to record with a suitable resolution and also FPS. The mirror option can change the webcam if you want to switch to another one. After you stop recording, the editing window will pop up again. You can choose to trim the video or click the open output folder to check it. Before selecting the record game feature, you can choose whether to show mouse cursor and keystrokes in the settings. Next, click on record game feature. A toolbar will pop up. Click the drop down box and select the game you want to record. Take League of Legends for example. The game will automatically be recognized and shown here. If you want to show your webcam, choose the PIP feature. Then you can proceed to start recording as we mentioned before. You can also schedule the recording time and hit pause screen recorder. Go to the task settings, check automatic stop. You can set when to stop recording and how long you want to record. Next the schedule recording feature allow you to decide record area and when to start. When you confirm the settings, a countdown will appear up here to remind you of the recording. Alright, these are the tools you can use as OBS alternatives. If you have other useful tools, welcome to leave your comments below. Thanks for watching. I'll appreciate it if you subscribe and give us a big thumbs up. See you soon video creators.